Hello everyone. So I'm just going to address something really quickly. Jack and I haven't done a challenge Tuesday this week. We haven't done any vlogging at all this week simply because it has just been absolute chaos. There's been days where we haven't been able to stay in our house because there's we've had loads of problems with the outside drains. Um, so and then obviously with holiday coming up, we're trying to do extra work in this week because we've got two and a half weeks off. So it's just been absolute chaos. Um, but today finally I have a full day where I'm not going to be doing anything. Um, well, work-wise, I'm not doing anything. So I'm going to actually be popping into town today just to get our last few bits that we might need for holiday. Um, because when you're packing, you suddenly think, oh my God, what if we need this? What if we need this? So I'm going to go and get the last few bits today, exchange the last few dollars up for Jack as well. Um, and then I think we're then all sorted for America. Just quickly, I'm just going to let you know, my hair looks like crap today because it just didn't want to work and now it looks like a cow pat on the top of my head. It's, uh, <laughs> it's definitely started off bad this, this, this Friday, isn't it? Jeez. Um, so that's what I'm going to be doing. I might take you along and see if there's anything in the shops. If not, I'll do a little haul later as to what I buy. Um, I'm also going to finish off our packing um, because tomorrow um, I'm working pretty much all day and then we're out at the Hop Festival. And then Sunday is literally our travel day to the airport. So I've got to kind of get everything sorted today. Um, so yeah, off to the shops. Okay, next thing I'm going to show you. I got something really, really cool. So you know on Facebook they do their selling sites. I got myself a pair of vans that look like they've been worn once for eight pound bargains. See, days can get better. Flipping bargains. Off to the shops we go. Okay, so I'm back in the car now. I've just been in town and done my shopping. I got everything that I needed. I kind of wanted to vlog whilst I was in town, but I kind of hit the fear. <laughs> like, it was quite busy in town. I, I mean, I don't mind this whole vlogging thing. I think it's just getting over the fear of people seeing you vlog. Because obviously it's not the most normal thing, seeing people talking to a camera. Um, I think if I was with Jack and we were in town, then maybe I'd have a bit more confidence to do it. Um, but again, it, I think this will come in time. Again, we're still quite new to vlogging, so it was a really weird feeling of getting out my camera, talking to it, whilst on my own, whilst in town. But again, I think this is something that will come in time and we'll get a bit more confident. Obviously, when we're on holiday, we're going to be trying to vlog as much as we can. So it, it will start getting a bit more natural, I guess. Um, I did get everything I wanted in town though. I think I did lose my shopping list, so I'm kind of guessing that I did get everything that I wanted. Um, so I'll show you what I've got when I've got when I'm home. Um, I'll show you what we actually bought. Um, so yeah, see you in a bit. So I'm home now. I thought I'll show you the cool things that I got today um, whilst in town. First thing I did is I went into Debenhams and I'm a beauty club member. And um, once a month every Friday you get like um, a free gift and then today's free gift that we got was this Laura Geller um, Illuminator and it looks really cute. It's in Gilded Honey and it's, um, oh it's pretty, I don't know if you can see that, you probably can't. There we go, a little bit of shimmer there, but it's so pretty. Um, yeah, so that was my little freebie today. Um, I also got loads of um, little perfume samples as well. Uh, I've got some guys ones and some girl ones for me and Jack. Um, for just to try them out, see if there's any new ones that we want to try there as well. Um, okay, so onto the stuff that I got for holiday. So these are like the last minute things that we're going to get. So I got myself some um, little like facial wipes from Primark. And um, these are really 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 good I use them all the time but the, pa the thing with these ones is they're like a triple pack and they're actually for a travel size so you can actually take these on the plane with you so um, that's really handy so I've got, got myself two umbrellas for in the parks I've got a slightly more expensive one in Primark again it's pretty basic so if it breaks it breaks it doesn't matter and then I've got a really cheap one for a pound in Poundland so if one breaks and we have a spare, um, again, we're going out of hurricane season, so it's very likely to be nice and rainy out there when we go. Um, sweets for the plane. Obviously, we're going to need lots of sweets. 
it's a nine and a half hour flight, so we need something good like that. Uh, things as well, I got I got these little toothpaste um, toothbrush holders because we're staying in a few different places whilst we're away, so it's really handy to transport our um, toothbrushes in that. Uh, travel size shaving cream because I didn't have one, now I do. Um, I also got from Poundland a neck, um, what are they called? I don't even know, neck rest thing I guess. Um, I got one for Jack, I don't know if he needs it or not, but it was a pound and it comes with a little handy clip. So at least then um, if he does want one, he doesn't nick my one. He's got his own little one now there as well. Um, I also got some digital luggage scales. These are from Primark and they were four pound. Um, I don't know how good they'll be, if they're accurate. I like to think that they're accurate. Um, but I'll let you know how we get on with those. So it's really handy because obviously if you're shopping out in America, um, and you're bringing loads of stuff back or I'd hate to be over the limit we've got quite a big limit anyway but this, this looks quite handy and also we've lost our um, other ones that we had um, chewing gum because when you're on a plane get a dry mouth got loads of those I also got myself some small gold earrings I don't know if you notice I literally live in gold earrings so um, I got some slightly smaller ones from we're at the parks um, and these ones were £2 from Primark and they're quite pretty actually they've got three different styles on there um, what else did I get? Oh, and I got these, um, they're not for holiday, but they were only 50p, and these travel or, um, travel organisers, what am I on about? See, I'm stuck in the mo <laughs> in holiday mode. A beauty organiser. Um, 50p, bargain, I got two of them, so. That's that, and some pocket tissues, because obviously they're really handy. And then um, I got me and Jackson face masks, that's his one, I've already got one of mine. Um, so, when we go to the Block Hotel, I think we're going to do some face masks, have a little bit of a chill out just before um, we fly. So yeah, that's what I've got today. Nothing massively exciting. And again, it was just like the last minute things that we needed. Um, I also got Jack some dollars. Um, and that's about it really. So I'm just going to literally do some packing this evening. And then I think we'll be ready to go, which is crazy. Bearing in mind we've been counting down for 199 days. Like it's coming quick i'm so excited it's insane um i just need this holiday now i think i've earned it i like to think i've earned it yeah so um yeah that's all the stuff i got today um all right so um i think i'm almost done with my packing it's looking pretty full now so i've pretty much got everything in there every single type of clothes for loads of different occasions and then over here i have got my hand luggage i've decided to take my little um woolen booties instead for the plane just because they're that little bit um warm also this weekend um jack's actually away um so we're going up to the airport sunday night however jack is away tonight which is friday and tomorrow night which is saturday and then he's going to be meeting me at the airport he's actually away with um, a race team he helps with the pit crew so he's away doing that so i've actually got a home alone tonight um gonna have a bit of a chill um looking a bit rough because i'm just taking my makeup off gonna have a bath cup of tea have a little bit of a pamper maybe I might do a little bit of a face mask um um yeah just a nice little chill so I have got my bath all run now, nice and bubbly. Um, I've got my cup of tea in my favourite mug at the moment. And I am going to be trying out this face mask. I think it's back to front for you right now. But it's a Manuka Honey Peel Off Mask. It's not, I'm not even joking, like, this packet feels empty. <laughs> there's, there's like hardly anything in there. So I'll, just, I'll see if there's enough actually to use. I'm hoping there is and I haven't been ripped off here. Um, but apparently it removes dead cells, so maybe, maybe it'll be good. We'll give it a go. I'll let you know. Room of the telly. I have got my extra cup of tea 
because I've already had one. Um, I've got some French biscuits from my friend who came back from France, so I'm going to eat those. And I'm going to catch up and watch uh, Pitch Perfect Free. And then that's probably my evening sorted. Looking rough, just got out of the bath, so feeling fresh. Um, so I'm going to say bye now, and then the next time you'll see us, we'll probably be on our way to the airport. Well, I will be, and um, Jack's going to be meeting there. Me there, so this is really exciting. As you can tell, I'm a little bit psycho. One more night, one more day, that is it. And then we are officially on holiday. So I will see you soon. Keep watching.